Alrighty guys, I'm the devil, otherwise known as Kyle, and this is Castle Quest. So here we go. Alrighty guys, welcome back to Castle Quest and today, today we're doing something a little bit different. We've been working a little bit on our, on our project and I have... I've uh, been growing some sugar cane, which is good. Somebody's been in my area because this is all grown up one, which is pretty good. But today, today, um, I was actually asked to do a little bit of a tour of the server. So I'm going to do that. We're going to go ahead and we're going to have a look at other people's bases and see what everybody else has been up to. Because to be honest, I haven't actually really gone around and actually looked at other people's bases just yet. So it'd be quite interesting to see that. So let's just store some of this stuff away. I um, think I'll cook the mutton. We go and uh, I'm more disorganized. I did actually go ahead and get quite a bit of a case of wood, as you can see. And we are going to continue work on the castle now. Uh, I have been left a little gift from Runic. We've got a helmet, which is pretty badass. Uh, we've got you have to be awesome. We've got the the eliminators chest plate, only for the best, the most epic. Look at the stuff on this sharpness, uh, sort of like sword. Bunny charm, hunger charm. So, does this mean that. Oh! Look at that! Check that out! And look at that feather fall in 10. And we've got protection 3 and unbreaking 1 on those. Not eaten by mortals and never can be. So. This actually, I think this means that we don't get hungry. If we have these charms on us, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, look at that. That's that's pretty cool. So we can actually go ahead and check out some other people's bases. Okay, so this is my base, obviously. We'll start the tour here. Uh, this was my beginning shack. And uh, that, which I'm going to tear this down, actually, at some point. Uh, because we're obviously building a castle over here. Uh, unfortunately, I'm going to... If I take this out of my hotbar, do I still have it? Yes. Does it wear off because it's not in my... Um... Oh, no, it still works even though it's not in my hotbar. That's pretty cool. But it does stop me from running super fast. I've only got five seconds of it left. Four, three, two, one. Yeah, if it's not in the hotbar, it wears off. That's all right, then. And obviously, we've got our castle here. Okay, which I've not finished, and we are still going to do some more work on it. But I do actually want to come over here for... A very important reason. I do believe I left my bed over here. Uh, we've got some chests. Heard you could use some stuff from your new server god. Hey! Check that out! Thank you very much, Runic. That's going to be big on helping me build this thing. Uh, we are going to get back to it. So I think I'm going to... I've got to do the, uh, the wall. So I think I might do that in a live stream. So, if we go to spawn, we'll check out spawn. Uh, it helps if you type in spawn. So this is spawn. This was uh, runic and lollipop. There was a little thing that did say this here. We had a little bit of a trolling experience from runic a couple of days ago, uh, which resulted in TNT and uh, a big hole. So yeah, this is runic slash lollipop space. And obviously, it's a nice old castle all walled in. We've got a couple of nice little houses here. And I'm glad that I brought my bed. You can't actually mine, I don't think, in spawn. No. I didn't think you could. So how far outside of spawn do I have to be before I can do anything? Okay, come on. Oh, wow. Those look awesome. I haven't seen those before. And I don't have any fireworks to get up there. So unfortunately, we can't actually take a look at them. But yeah, so this is spawn. Like I said, this is Lollipop and Runic. Got a sugar cane farm. Got a nice little crane looking really nice up there. Uh, we've got this here, which I suppose this symbolizes like all sorts of stuff that's been lifted in and imported into the castle, which looks really cool. Some some barrels of hay. This, which looks really cool. Not sure what this is supposed to be. Armor enchantment. Armor merchant, sorry. So, yeah. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, you can't actually can't see inside the chests, but that's okay. Got a couple of houses. Got this house here. And it looks like this goes down to a basement, maybe Runix mine. Let's have a little look. 
Death's crafting table. Death's crafting table. You stole two of my crafting tables. <laughs> they stole my crafting table. I found my crafting table and I... I could mine it. Alright. Found it. I can't remember what was on there. I apologize for that. I didn't actually think expect to mine it. At least it was at least it was saved in the video. So we can actually go back and have a look what was in there. But yeah, this this base is actually pretty cool. This was runic and lollipop as I said. And it does it's coming along pretty good. Level seven, Infernal Skeleton. Where is it? Uh let me down. My guess is it's underneath. I do know that Runic's been doing a lot of custom stuff on the server, like custom mobs, custom enchants. Uh, it's really spicing up the server. I'm really, I'm really a fan of it myself. I like it. I like it. Again, we've got all of this over here, so this is pretty cool. Now, I'm not 100% certain if I'm going to get, going to get to everybody's base today, uh, but I'm going to take a look at a couple of people's bases, and maybe we'll do another tour to take another look at a couple of others. Now, this is only one of Runic's base. Please ask me on Discord if you need anything from these chests. It took a while to get all these, so please do not steal. Thank you, Runic Bob. Okay. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going to make some air blocks because, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, that's, that's pretty cool. So this is Runic's base, or at least, you know, I'm not going to get in super in-depth about it. Maybe we'll do an episode dedicated to just a single base in the future when we go and actually have a look around. Maybe we'll do an episode, pair up with somebody and swap tours of their bases and I'll do a more in-depth, uh, obviously, base tour then. Right now, I'm just right now I'm just kind of showing this is Runic's little shop. Um, I should put some stuff in here. Um, drawing the trolling. But yeah, and over here, I'm not sure what this is. It's like the birch kingdom and I'm not sure who did this so yeah it's just just a bunch of stuff with the the ender dragon head farm and of course we've got this down here which actually I haven't seen this since uh, the last time I was here so this is looking pretty good this is definitely looking good so oh I love these airships like, I don't know who did the airships. I've not seen the episode. So, you know, say it's me if you're the one who did the airships so that I can go ahead and and, and check out that episode because I'd really love to see the episode these were done in. Because these look amazing. And this is Max over here. Max is probably the person who... I don't want to say I get along the most with on the server, but it's definitely the person that I've had the inter most interaction with on the server when it comes to actually just being on at the same time. Like, unfortunately, I'm never on when Runic's on, which is kind of unfortunate. Uh, whoever takes it first gets it. Obviously, we work quick enough. But yeah, Maxine is someone that um, that is actually on the server quite a lot when I'm on. I'm so surprised that they're not on at the minute. Uh, they're usually on in the morning when I'm on. So I'm guessing Max is UK as well. we got a Scarecrow here, shoulder and the Scarecrow. And we've got, what's this? Runic's Yard Sale. Take only what you need, not what you want. Leave some stuff for other members. Okay. So. That's pretty good. So it's just pretty much take what you want. Um, okay, well, I'm not going to nick anything. So if we look in here, we can see everybody's bases here. And I think what we'll do is we'll... I do want to check out Deaths, and I do want to check out Max's base. Obviously, we don't want to check out the end. Runic's got another base. Uh, obviously, we see my base. Pineapple's base. Again, it's somebody who I see regular videos of Pineapple. Teddy's base. So, yeah. Uh, let's go check out Max's base. Because I have seen pictures of this in the Discord, and I think that Max is a quite a unique builder, to say the least. Like, this is not an organic shape that you see after you don't see stuff like this regular you know it's not something i mean look at how many like curves it's going on here and just a little like you know you've got this like these indented stairs here which just add this like this whole new layer of depth it's something that you don't see very often and really 
really blends well. It just looks amazing. This house does look absolutely amazing. I can't wait to see it when they finish it. And I'm not sure if Max is a boy or a girl, because Max is a you know a unisex name. So I apologize if I am completely calling you something that you are not. Uh, but I like the small house here because it's just it, this is so small. And normally, small things like this, they're small, they're insignificant, they're overlooked. There's there's a staircase going down. Okay. But this, this actually, you notice this. This is really good. And I love the way that they've just blended it together. They've used blocks here instead of panes to create, again, another layer of depth. And I think this is amazing. And this stable. Oh, this is beautiful. This is... Like, when you're on a server, you get so many people who have so many different types of building styles. You just get some really awesome and unique stuff. Obviously... I'm assuming this is... Oh, hello, Max. I found your hidden... Your hidden library that... You saw nothing. But yeah, obviously... Clearly storage, what's this? This is the AFK fish farm, and then Max has an AFK fish farm. Which is obviously right here. Which we should probably build an AFK fish farm. But the problem is, right, if I build an AFK fish farm, this is exactly what will happen. Runic will come and do something to me while I'm fishing, because obviously I'll be fishing, uh, and I'll be asleep, I'll, I'll do it overnight. Uh, but it won't be night for Runic, it'll be day for Runic, and Runic will be like, you know what, I'm gonna troll, I'm just, I'm just gonna troll the devil, and he's gonna move me somewhere, but what the hell is down here? I'm guessing this goes to Max's mines, this is really, really beautiful, and just, I love this base. Hmm. So it's just pretty generic strip mines, nothing too fancy down there, but the fanciness is all above the surface with Max. You know, it's like, hey, come look at my base, it's like super mega awesome, and it is. This house is clearly unfinished, so this is something that I like doing. I like looking at bases, and then, you know, we'll come back here in 20 episodes, and take a little look and see exactly what Max has done, and it'll be completely different, and we'll just have our minds blown yet again. It's just amazing, and I guess this is... Either a mob farm or an iron farm. Iron. I wonder if Max will be selling iron. If you're selling iron, Max, let me know. Uh, I'm trying to collect the iron for a beacon, and I'd really rather not spend forever mining it. So, yeah, let's go back to spawn. Uh, I, I wish that... Do you know this, like, base building out here was actually somewhere near spawn? So you could, like, spawn and then go to somebody else's base. Now... Clearly, this is somebody's base here. And, you know, I don't know if one of these buttons is going to take us up there. But, unfortunately, I might be able to get up there through that lighthouse there. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so Death. Death is someone who I have watched every episode of her Let's Play of this. No touch me planning. Okay, so I, I'm guessing that, that Death currently hasn't done too much. I know... No way, Death. You are totally not building the Guardian farm out here. I know the death was AFK fishing at some point. Although I wouldn't really want to AFK fish out here. But just, just, no way. It's just, this is such a monumental undertaking that mine just... I would not have the time. I don't even have one in my single player world. Uh, and I have no plans to build one because they're just. They take forever. No way. This is going to be super awesome if she is. Uh, but I'm not sure if this is death. I'm going to say it is because obviously Death's Island is right there. Uh, Eel. Or maybe this is Tom. I don't know what these books represent. Uh, I don't actually know Tom. I've not really seen him in the Discord. So, Tom, if you're watching this video, go ahead and leave a comment down below so I can come to your channel and subscribe to you. Uh, we got portion of water breathing. That was like so posh, that potion sound. Uh, we got some, some, some cooked fish. Uh, but yeah, just this is a monumental. Well, he's, he's done the hard bit. He's cleared it out. He's done the hard bit. That's a hard bit. So... Yeah, just amazing. Uh, let's sleep. So I think this is Tom, not Death, but 
whoever this is, it's just an amazing, monumental undertaking. That was my bed, right? I didn't put my bed over here, did I? No. Okay. Unfortunately, there's not much to show of deaths. I do know that death had another base. She started off somewhere over there. But yeah, uh, unfortunately, I don't think the teleport takes us there. But like I said, we will check out... We will do individual base tours at some point in the future. But right now, there's not much to show. But uh, Runix suggested that I do this. And I thought, you know what? I'm, I'm going to go ahead and do this. We've done maxes. Um, we have seen Runix base. This I like. The... Just the idea that this is like uh, one of them. This is like the chain off of a chainsaw that's just bringing things in and out of the nether. And obviously, I mean, it, it is a shame that you can't like build something inside the, the portal frame. So you would have sort of like one half in and half out. And you just sort of see it there, but that's that's Mojang. But this looks really nice. And I like these ideas, these, these brazers here. These look really cool. But again, just another talented builder that's just got some really unique stuff and clearly an auto smelter that's uh, never seen one like that before. That must take some time to get, that obsidian. Llama Rama. Mini tree farm. Bear, to you too. Oh, I don't like you either. Bear. I bet Runix trained them to be like that to me. I bet you. Definitely, this is just, I don't know if he, if he used a beacon for this or not. That's just amazing. The time it must take you to clear this out. This is amazing. What have we got it going on over here? A little bit of a uh, cobblestone generator. I suppose, maybe it's just a bit of random stuff, but yeah. Uh, this base I've seen a couple of times, I've actually been out here. Has he got an AFK fish farm as well? Yes, he does. Everyone's AFK fishing, we should probably AFK fish as well. Or maybe I'll just wait for someone to sell a mending book or something. So yeah, really cool base by by Runic, and I've really got to learn how to spell spawn. Really got to learn how to spell spawn. So actually I'm going to grab a screenshot of this room for the thumbnail, I think. I don't really know any way to incorporate everybody's bases into the thumbnail. So I think if we just did... Like that. Okay. Because uh, obviously there's nothing at the end. We've been there a couple of times. We've got Pineapple's base, Teddy's base to go. So, Pineapple. I'm... I think Pineapple's close to me. I'm going back three or four hundred blocks that way. I do remember coming through a, a mesa chopping down trees and coming across the village. So... Be pretty cool. Let's see what let's see what um, let's see what pineapples got. I actually been uh, seeing a lot of pineapples videos go up actually. So hey, I got my own now. So this one is yours again, Max. Okay, so beach stripes. Hello, you're safe. Okay, diorite and granite. Quite quite a unique block palette there. I gotta say, and obviously. Storage stuff here. So, does this go down into the mines? I'm, I'm imagining this is either his mines or he's got an underground base. Let's let's find out. Yeah, j just just strip mines. Okay. So nothing really too much from pineapple. And I think we got one more base to take a look at, don't we? I think we got Teddy's base to take a look at. And then, while we, then we're going to get back to work on our base. So, the next episode we are going to resume work. I think I'm going to do a stream between now and then to do that wall, I think. Let's go to Teddy's base. Wee! <laughs> bound and bound we go. Okay. So, be right. My apologies, that was my phone. So, yeah. Teddy, pretty cool base. I do like. <laughs> okay, I, I, I like this. Yay! So much fun. <laughs> oh, I'm an idiot. Yeah, I think that's actually everyone's base. I don't think there's much more to show. If I've missed something, then please do let me know. I'm gonna 
go ahead now and make sure that I am subscribed to everybody on this channel. And if you are a subscriber of mine, please do so. I will put a link to everybody's channel down in the description as and when I get the channel. So if it's not there to begin with, it will be there before I'm finished. There's an Enderman currently there. So yeah. But I, 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 I want to share something with you. Just very briefly, guys. Currently, I am being bombarded by the beast from the east. And if you don't know what the beast from the east is, or the beast from the west, it's the beast from the east. Uh, it's currently a snowstorm pounding. It's, it's dreadful here, so if videos are a little bit sketchy over the next couple of days, it's because the internet is constantly up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. So it may take me just a little while. We didn't actually get to look at this base, actually. I want to see if I can get up there. So I'm not sure whose base this is, actually. It's really awkward when people uh, use a different name on YouTube and in-game Minecraft name as they do on Discord. Like, I try to use the same name universally, so, you know, Kyle the Devil Davis, so people know who I am. But some people, you know, they have different names for Discord, different names for Minecraft. But yeah, can I get up here? Is there, like, a way in? No. We could pillow up. But I don't really want to. But yeah. So yeah, I think that's going to do it for this episode, guys. So, if you have enjoyed the video, I wonder what this is for. Oh, we're taking a lot of damage. If you have enjoyed the video, please do consider leaving a like. And please click subscribe if you want to see more from me. I'm the devil, and thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And in the next episode, we'll continue our castle. Until then, I'll see you later. Goodbye!